Hello and welcome to my channel, History of Kurdish. Today I want to explain history of who was the first to launch the name Kurdistan. Before I beginning explain, don't forget, subscribe channel. Extension of the historical roots of the Kurdish people in the depths of Kurdistan In this article, I refer to extracts from the history of the Kurdish people dating back to different times, in chronological order, to show the historical facts that emphasize the Kurdish people's longevity and being one of the oldest people in the world and living in their homeland, Kurdistan since before history, to be read by dear readers and readers the Kurds and those who hate the Kurdish people who claim that the Kurdish presence in Kurdistan does not exceed several centuries and who aim in their efforts to show the Kurdish people as a strange people in their homeland, Kurdistan and the region and uprooted the roots of the Kurdish people from the land of their ancestors, my desperate attempt to abort the struggle of Kurdistan to liberate their homeland rapist and freeing the people of Kurdistan from the occupation and dependency and save the identity, language and culture Kurdish cancellation and ridding the history of the Kurdish heritage of cancellation and denatured, theft and stop the looting and theft of Kurdistan resources by the occupiers. They are also trying to impede the march of the ancient Kurdish people to contribute again, like their Suveri, Sumerian, Alayim, Haarite, and Mitanni, to the human civilization with its creations, innovations, ideas, arts and literature. However, the Kurdish people continue their struggle and achieve their goals of liberation and independence. 1. Name Kurdistan, the area called Kurdistan today known as the country of the Kurds for thousands of years, where the Sumerians called the area Korda Gatiam, which means land Karda, and the Assyrians were called Kordi, and Babylonians they called it Gardo. And the Greeks called it Kardashoi, and the Romans called it Kordron, and was mentioned in the name of Kurdistan in the name of Kardo, Gardo. The Arameans launched the name BT Gardo on Kurdistan, which means country of the Kurds. A Roman historian and soldier in the 4th century AD, about 1,700 years ago, when he reached the Heptaners, he clearly points to the new map of Kurdistan, where he says that the area stretching from Nineveh, passing through Erbil until the city of Hamadan is the country of the Hepbanians. This is the oldest indication of the new geography of Kurdistan in history. Nineveh was at that time a much larger province than the one we find today. It also included parts of the eastern and northern parts of present Kurdistan, while the other parts of eastern and northern Kurdistan were under the rule of Romania at the time. About 1,700 years ago, it refers to the current geography of Kurdistan. It is worth mentioning that the Hebbanis belonged to a tribe that established an ancient Kurdish state, where they belonged to the Hori era, before the Assyrians came to the region, and that the origin of the family of Salah al-Din Ayyubi back to this tribe, where Kurdistan was known as the country of Hathbani in the 4th century AD, i.e., before the Arab Islamic occupation of Kurdistan about 300 years. Map of the Islamic world, drawn by Mahmud Kashgari in 1076 AD, or 938 years ago, where Kurdistan Kurdish land. This is another proof of the historical depth of the Kurds in Kurdistan. The first to be named Kurdistan on the homeland of the Kurds is the Seljuk Sangar Sultan in the middle of the 6th century AD, more than 800 years ago, more than 800 years ago, Lee String, land in the east of the Age of Differences, 1930. 2. The name of the Kurds. The Kurds were mentioned in an ancient historical document dating back to the 3rd millennium BC, which is two tablets of stone engraved with a Sumerian text, previously by the great minister of Sumerian Sushan, 2037 to 2029 BC. Ordered that they be placed under the base of the door of a new temple built in Jeru Tello in southern Iraq. After he mentions a series of titles and positions, he mentions that he is the military governor of Erbil, the governor of Kamas and Kar, and the military commander of the people of Su and the country of Korda. These areas mentioned by the minister Sumerian are all within the current Kurdistan. During the writing of the text, the ancestors of the Kurdish Kurds lived in most parts of Kurdistan. The Kara Kar region, located in the upper Reaches of the Diyala River, is considered one of the most important political centers of the Hori. It is worth mentioning that the two tablets currently in the Louvre Museum in Paris, have been excavated by a French mission in Tillo in southern Iraq. Professor Manfred Miller. And Professor Olsner translated it into German. Thus, this Sumerian document refers to the Kurdish presence in Kurdistan more than 4,000 years ago. 
about 2,000 years ago, Strabo mentions the name of the Kurds, saying, near the Tigris River are the areas belonging to the word winking face, formerly known as Kardochi. As for the origin of the Kurds, Yulia Chalabi, born in Istanbul in 1611 or 1616 AD, states the following, according to the traveler Al-Makdisi Muhammad ibn Ahmad ibn Abi Bakr Al-Makdisi, known as Shams al-Din Al-Makdisi, born in Jerusalem in 947 AD, the division of the knowledge of the regions, that after the flood of Noah, the city of Judi was first reconstructed and then the reconstruction of the fortress of Shankar Sinjar, and then Neoperkin. The king, Kordom, was the owner of the city of Judi was a nation of Noah. Lived for 600 years and toured throughout Kurdistan. When he arrived in the city of Neoparkin, Neoparkin is located in the northeast of the city of Ahmad Diyabakir, between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers. This king loved the city's atmosphere and settled there. He had many sons and grandsons, where they found a language of their own which is not Arabic or Persian or Hebrew and Aldria, and this language is now called the Kurdish language and is spoken in Kurdistan. This is how the Jerusalemite traveler tells us about the Kurdish presence in Judi, Chingar and Nefarkin, and tells us about the existence of the Kurdish language. 3. The Superers, the professor Merdad Izadi, professor of ancient history at Harvard University, the American Ard mentions that the oldest of the Badanian Kurdish clan is the Zibar clan and that this tribe descends from the Suvari source one. The discovery of the Superian ruins. In the Zibar region in southern Kurdistan is proof that the Zibar clan is an extension of the Sobrians. In this area north of the city of Erbil, the ruins of a school for children dating back to the Suvari were found. For children and young people in account science, multiplication tables and dictionaries. Numerous books and letters were also found, such as instruments, restrictions, mathematical and astronomical issues, and historical texts in this region. The American scholar Jelb states that the Savarians originated from non-Semitic mountain peoples such as the Ghatans and the Kwasites and that the Horus the Khoris, came from the Savaris source too. The Suparis and the Sumerians lived together in the current Kurdistan and the presence of the Supare in Kurdistan is very old, back to more than 5,000 years and that their presence in Kurdistan preceded the migration of Samians to Kurdistan and the establishment of the Assyrian state more than 2,000 years. 4. Korean, Dr. Jamal Rashid Ahmed points out that Geiger mentions that the name of the Karites is associated with the name of the god Hvar, the sun god, where the name of the sun is still in the Kurdish language as Kh Kurdish studies in Suparto, Baghdad. 1984, p. 25, 26. This designation in the lands of Subarto and its deepening in a religious sense and then in a national sense to all the people who believed in the sun god and the light in the land of Subarto of Gatan, Lolian and Kassan has a great historical significance, as it means that this human group worshipped a common god and performed a ritual religious common. The religions that prevailed in the land of Subarto, claimed the primacy and grandeur of the sun god among other gods. Dr. Jamal Rashid Ahmed says that the name of the sun god is still in the same area as Kermatu Tuskumato, Taza Kermato, as is the case with the name Pagadato, which became Pagadat, i.e., the tenderness of the god Baga. Dr. Jamal Rashid Ahmed says that most of the vocabulary of the core language is now used in the current Kurdish language on a large scale. Dr. Jamal Rashid Ahmed, A Language Study on the History of the Kurdish Country, Freedom House, Baghdad, 1980. P. 99. From this it appears that the language of the Medes, the language of the Avenue Sta, and the current Kurdish language is an extension of the language of the core, where the Kurdish thinker Masood Muhammad in his research published in his book. Tongue of the Kurds, issued in 1987, the sacred language of the Zoroastrian religion, Avenue Sta, written in an ancient Kurdish language and that the Mukarian dialect is the same as the language of the Avenue Sta and the Mukarian is in eastern Kurdistan still. Maintain the avenue, sta and speak it. The Superian vocabulary, which is the vocabulary of the mystical letter, was found. Thus, the Khmer Mitanni language is an extension of the Superian language, since the Karites are the descendants of the Suvari source 3. Means that the Kurds were living in the current Kurdistan more than 3,400 years ago, where the Kurds are descendants of the Khoris. 5. The Medea Empire 708 to 560 BC, Medea was a challenge from the east of Afghanistan. 
some of the territory of Afghanistan was part of Medea, from the west to the Mediterranean Sea and from the north to the Kados region beyond the Aras River and from the south to the Persian Gulf. The Median Empire included Persia, Armenia, Assyria, Ilam, Hyrkani, and part of Pakistan on the Indian Ocean and northeastern Syria. The Median Empire was overthrown by the Persian Achaemenids in 560 BC, where the empire lasted for about 150 years. Say states that the Medes were made up of Kurdish tribes living east of the Assyrian Kingdom, where the boundaries of their homeland extended to the southern Caspian Sea. The majority of this population was from Indo Uribe. M. SAEs, the History of the Historians, Part 2, 1918. The language of the Medes is the current language spoken by the Kurdish people today. Hassan Pai, Rani A., The History of Iran from the Ancient Times to the Fall of the Sassanid State, 2nd edition, 1927. Masood Muhammad, in his book, Masood Muhammad mentions that. The Moorish Kurdish tribes still retain the Midi language, since the dialect they speak is the Midi language. Sir Wilson says that the Kurds are the descendants of the Medes. Source 4. In the 15th and 12th centuries BC, the people of Neri, who is the ancestor of the Medes, lived in the central part of Kurdistan, and this people bore the name of the Kurds later. Mazdar V. In the days of the glory and superiority of the people of the people, the people of this country were a great force and authority that had a clear interest in terror and prestige in the hearts of all peoples and nations neighboring it. Ibn Khaldun says that the Kurds are descended from the Medes Abdurrahman ibn Muhammad ibn Khaldun, the lessons and the Dewan of the beginner and the newser in the days of the Arabs, Ajum, Berbers and their contemporaries among the Sultan of the nations neighboring it. Great. Hassan Purnia states that the Medes are the Aryan peoples who are the ancestors of the Kurds and their language is the same as that of the Macedonian Kurds living in eastern Kurdistan, Hassan P. 1927, and in his book, Love and Sultana, Hassan Purnia says that medieval is a Kurdish language. Thus, the ancestors of the medieval Kurds established a great empire in the region more than 2,700 years ago. Thank you for watching it, and don't forget like and comment, and subscribe my channel.